When Goldilocks committed a B and E and raided what? the fridge in the bear's home, wow, she, <laughs> breaking and entering. Yeah. She tried Actually. Papa Bear's avocado toast and said, Uh-oh. "This toast has too much gluten." Ooh. She tried Mama Bear's toast and said, "This toast is too gluten free." Oh, oh, you need yeah. a little perfect so, amount of gluten. Yeah. And she tried Baby Bear's toast and said, "This toast is just." Woo! <laughs> it's TikTok click shot because we're so shocked at how many clicks that viral video has been getting. Got some of the biggest TikToks of the past week ready. Let's get into your first TikTok click shot, which is from a 20 something year old woman in New York named Sam Dean. She recently went on her TikTok to share a helpful life hack for when Ooh, you're I out in a public place and the people around you are being too loud and annoying. Oh, ah. what do you do? How do you get them to shut up? Well, yeah. here's her idea. Here's a scam for the girls and the guys. If you're ever at a hotel or I've used this on airplanes as well, where people are next to you and being really loud and rude and you like want to ask them to be quiet, but you don't want to be a about it. If you say to them, hey, I'm sorry, could you please quiet down? I have to wake up really early for a funeral tomorrow. Oh. Every time, they immediately feel so bad, and they will quiet down instantly. Oh, Oh, wow. Why does that feel wrong? I love that on TikTok, you can just lie to a stranger and call that a life hack. Yeah. Now every every time Brooks annoyed me in the studio, every day, she's going to be like, I got a funeral tomorrow. (laughs) Keep it down. (laughs) Lots of funerals this week. True. The video got almost 2 million views, and the comments Uh, were blowing up with people calling Sam a genius. Oh, really? really? So people are for this. One person wrote, immediate vibe killer. I absolutely love you for this. Oh, my God. Another woman chimed in saying, a guy on a plane was trying to flirt with me. He was talking about his vacation and asked me about my trip. I said I went to a funeral. He backed off real quick. Oh, Okay, oh, so guy. creepy guys are scared of death. Yeah. Is that what it comes down to? <laughs> no one wants to continue that conversation no. yeah. about the funeral. I don't know. I bet there's a few people who do. <laughs> you know, <laughs> Not everybody loves the idea, though. Some say yeah. it's bad karma to put a fake death oh. out into the universe just for your own benefit. It just feels like you're like using people's empathy yeah. to, mm-hmm. Well, to all my annoying people like me out there, if someone uses this on you, just say, hey, I have a funeral to go to tomorrow, too. Yeah. 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 One? Where's so, yours? Alexis, are you using this to get free? drinks at the bar oh for sure <laughs> yeah i can fake some tears i could really <laughs> use a shot right now i have a funeral to go yeah. to tomorrow and i'm super sad about yeah. it <laughs> i can make my mascara run a little yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's a tiktok click shock you're next Woo, tiktok click shock is a hot new workplace trend for millennials and gen zers on how to stick it to your boss because they're paying you to actually do work Ugh! Wow! I thought of that. Oh my God! Are you with them? You're not with them? No. <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> but I'm on board for this. For a while, it was all about quiet quitting. Right. Where right. you do yeah. a really terrible job and just don't try or care at all. I think it's just like the minimum. You just do the status that's, quo. That's what I said. Do a terrible job. I don't think that's the same. <laughs> it is okay. the same. If you don't try, that's doing a bad job. It's like, yeah, low effort. You don't okay. go above and beyond. But anyway, continue. We're so, above. Th- yeah. <laughs> That was so 2022, though. Okay. That's done. This year, there's a fun new way to flip the bird to your manager for them asking you to complete all your tasks and not getting to work from home five days a week. So this new one is called Rage Applying. Rage Applying. It's where you get really frustrated at work, and in just 60 minutes, you take all that angry, negative energy, and you frantically apply for as many (laughs) other jobs as you can. (laughs) Of course, on company time. Wow. You don't want to use personal I, time for that. My friends have definitely done this. You just go through LinkedIn and just... I think that's what's going to get you fired. They still have their yeah. jobs. They do? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Here's a 29-year-old TikToker who goes by Red Wheeze online <laughs> explaining what happened to her when she did it. This is your sign to keep rage applying to jobs because I got mad at work and I rage applied to like 15 jobs. And then I got a job that gave me a $25,000 raise. Whoa! And, uh, it's a great place to work. So keep rage applying. It'll happen. Yeah. Wow. Could, could she, like, turn off the TV in the background while she's recording a video? <laughs> it, I mean, I'm just reco- I know we're sound people, but, yeah. like, please. I yeah. also hope yeah. that she didn't have, like, an in-person interview because she was so boring. Yeah. yeah. Can you imagine yeah. her rage? I was upset at work, and so I applied to this job. You oh, 25000 Wow, I'm shocked. <laughs> 
I bet she hit enter really hard, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah you know? totally. So, yeah, to rage apply, you send out as many applications as you can in an hour while screaming at the top of your lungs at your computer <laughs> until you get a raise. Just at okay. your cubicle? Yeah. Just, ah, fly! <laughs> ah, enter! And according to Red Wings, <laughs> it's actually working. In fact, right now, the hashtag rage apply is over 13.3 million views on TikTok. Whoa. But it does beg the question, do employers need to ask you now, like, so is this a regular application or a rage application? Because I need to know what emotional state you were in when you submitted oh, it. True. Or it just needs to know if you're going to get a raise or not. I mean. But <laughs> if they ask you that, you life hack and you say that you just attended a funeral. There it and is. And that'll oh, shut them up. There it is. You take the new job and then instantly start rage applying for the next one <laughs> till you reach the top. <laughs> I you get frustrated at training. <laughs> yeah. That's it. That's <laughs> how Bezos did it. Yep. Yep. Those are your Woo, TikTok click shots. Wow. Stories for the day. Hopefully. Well, the show is over, but you can relive it all right now at brookandjeffrey.com. Woo!